Next thing, NTP startup value. It defines the accuracy of the time source. Uh, even we can say that it's a distance between the networking device and the authoritative time source. Now, in general, uh, let's take an example. The NTP server can be some external clock. So maybe some external clock on the internet or maybe some kind of atomic clocks on the internet. So NTP server and it is providing the time to some of my devices, maybe maybe one of my devices here, which is referred as NTP client. Okay, so, so this device is going to contact the external clock or NTP server on the internet to get a synchronized time. And I got some multiple devices here. Let's say I got some multiple devices. So I can configure all these devices to contact this NTP server on the external clock on the internet to, to get the synchronized time. Or I can configure this as an NTP server, which is my internal server probably and this internal server is like um, it is like a server for all the devices inside my network now this is my inside network and I want all my inside devices to contact this device 